Hi ladies and gentlemen. In this tutorial about Microsoft Outlook, I want to talk to you about searching for emails. Now one of the things I always tell people is if you have folders, and I have folders over here on the left hand side, that you put things in, you could go into that folder to look for an email. But if you can't find it, there's a chance that, well, maybe you deleted it or maybe, just maybe you put it in the wrong folder. But just for the sake of this tutorial, let's assume we don't know where the email is. At this very moment, I'm in the inbox, and you'll notice that there's an email that I've selected that's called Pan Mass Challenge. The Pan Mass Challenge is a charity bike ride that I've been doing for the last 20 plus years, and I get emails from them on a regular basis. So, if we want to search for something, I'm going to go up top to the search box, and I'm going to type in Pan dot mass and when I hit enter you're gonna see it searched my inbox the box I was in at this moment for any emails about the pan mass challenge but I know I've received emails from them throughout the years and they could be anywhere they could be in a number of places so when you're doing searches and I'm gonna click on this X to close it I'm going to come back up here for just a moment. I'm going to type in pan mass again. I'm just going to type in the word pan. And on this drop down right here, I can search the current folder. I can search subfolders, the current mailbox, which is my email account, or all Outlook items, which could be also on my calendar. As a rule of thumb, I just want to do the current mailbox or something very similar. But instead of having to come here every single time, I'm going to come over here to where it says File, and I'm going to go down to my Options. Under Options, you'll notice there's an area down here called Search, and I'm going to click on Search. And by default, it is set to the current folder. But what I want to do is I want to click on Current Mailbox, and I'm going to click OK. Now, let's see how that changed things. I'm going to come up here again and I'm going to start typing in pan mass and it's good to try to do it based on what you see in the heading of the email. Now you can search for things a lot of different ways but I'm just doing it this way. Now when I hit enter you'll notice that not only did it search the inbox but it searched throughout my email. So this is the better way to do it in my opinion. Once I have this, I can sort things based on any of the headings I have. I might not know when it was received or the subject. But now, instead of one email, in this case, I have found 75 different emails. And the place that I'm looking to see that number is down here on the bottom left, where it says Items 75. And that tells me how many emails it just found. So when you're using Search, I always recommend go into the settings and tell it to search the entire mailbox. And the mailbox is primarily your email account for a single email. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Tony Hollowitz. That's how you search for emails in Microsoft Outlook. Thank you.